What is up YouTube, Lazy Lama here, and here we are back with some Clicker Heroes. And uh, today we are uh, going to get on the grind and hopefully make some decent progress. Uh, it's been quite a few hours, I've been slacking, obviously not efficient. Um, have over doubled my level, which is pretty sweet. Uh, we've got quite a bit planned. I actually did beat the boss here. Um, what I did actually do is um, leveled it up, um, I think twice, I think it let us do, uh, which is pretty sweet. I love when we can level up the boss. I am going to be switching over to clicking here very shortly. Again, today is Clan Sunday, so we got a bunch going on. I haven't actually organized the clan sheet yet, uh, and I don't know if I'm going to have time to actually organize it. Uh, I will get everyone's name on it, but I don't know if it will be in order yet. I'm hoping I will. I'm going to try to do that here in just a couple minutes. Uh, but let's get going uh, real quick. Uh, let's go over a comment before we do anything else. Let's do one comment off the bat. Let me pull them up. We've got... Um, first one here I just found it kind of funny that's a little short little one but shout out to a new viewer or at least a new commenter um, that I haven't noticed before I believe it's it's either Joann's or Yoann's or Yoann's uh, it could be could be pronounced either way but um, normally I would say Joann's I guess but um, nonetheless uh, keep up the god work um, I think it was a misspell and I commented back I don't think I've heard anything back yet but uh I've commented about it, but I found it funny because I think it's meant to be good, but I mean, I will accept you calling my word godly, you know, I'll accept it. <laughs> but uh, anyways, I found it humorous, so I had to, I had to share it. Um, anyways, let's get to the clicking. We are coming out of idle for sure. Uh, let's get things moving. Should boost those. Again, I really don't care. I don't, I don't efficiently use those ever. So you guys know me. Uh, I do want to take care of the comments before uh, we get into all the clan nitty-gritty stuff and again we're gonna be doing some crazy jumps because we're gonna be doing the 10% and then the 18% and possibly even the 40% all in one go which just sets you up for a immense jump like we're gonna we're gonna go up crazy um, anyways a uh, little one here that we can actually talk a little bit about is from Josh here um, I'm struggling to get slash keep rubies how do you get so many I can't keep more than 50 at a time since I always transcend and hit, um, I never hit higher than 50. All right, so a couple things. First off, back when I was a lower level, I don't know what level you are, um, when I was a lower level, I had the same exact problem. It was the slowest grind to start getting up to the point of buying auto clickers. Um, I had such a hard time, I just could not get any ground. It, it just, I feel like that's something you deal with lower levels. I mean, I did learn ways to try to keep them up and realistically your best bet is to use your mercenaries. Um, I know it's hard and you're not going to have higher level mercenaries to do it very easy, but if you have a new mercenary, don't feel bad to just risk them on a two day or one day quest for a ruby. Like it takes, I mean, it's ruby a day and I know that's very minuscule, um, but you'll, it'll help level them. And when they're low levels, it really doesn't matter if they die or not. Like you can either revive them or just let them die. I mean, if you don't have rubies, I, I probably wouldn't be suggesting to revive them, but you do need to get higher level mercenaries to start grinding out the rubies, uh, as well as just clicking fish, which I'm sure you do. Um, but whenever you see a fish, click them. Uh, I have two monitors, so a lot of time, if I'm not playing a game, if I'm just like editing, I'll set my camera up on my second screen here. Um, it's a actually really crappy second screen. It's not really like a dual monitor. It's it's an old like CRT monitor, um, which if you don't know what that means, uh, it's basically the old um, cube monitors, like they're old bricks. <laughs> uh, I have not bought a new one, so I just kind of use this just to have as like a secondary stuff. But I pop my thing over there, uh, my, my game on that screen, and I'll just I'll click it. Um, if not, if you don't have that, pop back. Generally speaking, every five to ten minutes, if you just click on the game, if you if you're at your computer, anyways, um, and you'll generally have a ruby by then. Um, CJ has been working on it for a while, trying to figure out. I mean. It, realistically on average every five and a half minutes you get one um, but I mean it could be as simple as instantly you get a new one or it could be as long as you know I think theoretically you said I think it was like you shouldn't ever wait more than like a half hour or something uh, tops but I don't think I've ever waited more than 20 minutes personally like 20 22 minutes maybe uh, I don't know I've had some long grinds before when I was doing the pushing but it's a grind and I'm not gonna lie it, it is and you're gonna struggle and that's how it's gonna be for a little while uh, later in the game, like I said, it gets a lot easier. I can get up there pretty easy. Um, again, I haven't been spending them really. I mean, I buy a couple of these. I buy this every time I transcend. And then I haven't bought an auto clicker in a really long time. And I would never buy guilds or random milks. I would suggest never getting them. 
Um, two times damage is the best thing in the world. But uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much it as far as that goes. And this is the uh, the day of the J names because we've got another one here. Um, <laughs> Jacob coming in with, hey, Lazy Llama, what is your opinion on alpacas? They're basically just generic brand llamas. Um, well, I mean, technically, they're not even the same animal. But um, alpacas, you know, they aight. They, they, they're kind of cool, but they not they know they know llamas by any means um no but they're, they're kind of cool cool little dudes they got little afros so that gives them some bonus points but you know llamas are so much better llamas are better most llamas spit more honestly like that's like if you really think llamas are bigger um so you can ride them um actually i don't know if people do ride llamas but if i were gonna ride anything into war it would be a llama for sure i'd have a war llama kitted out um with you know armor and stuff you know that'd be that'd be the perfect mount in war like no tank no horse no nothing like that just you go in beautiful llama no but uh i mean they're bigger i mean they, they don't have the cool afros i guess in most cases i mean normally that's the alpacas like the weird bushy hair but uh i don't know i llamas are just awesome look up look up a video of llama attacks they're hilarious when llamas are just like chase people away or like pumble little kids because they don't generally like attack and attack but they'll knock you over they'll, they'll bump the chest bump you llamas are hilarious creatures <laughs> i don't know i've always loved llamas like i've always like even since i was like kind of young like i've, I've just been into llamas they've been cool i don't know they've always been my favorite animal llamas been just great <laughs> but uh yeah, that's about it. Uh, I'm going to let this kind of grind out for now. We'll come back. We have a ton of stuff to do uh, after with all the clan stuff and then uh, ascending. We've got a, it's going to take a decent bit of time. So I'm going to get the clan list worked out and uh, we'll come back then. All right, guys, we are back. Uh, push as far as I could go. I don't think I actually pushed that many zones. I mean, I could buy oh, a level of that. Um, keep pushing, but it's not worth trying to grind this anymore. We are ready to ascend i did get the clan sheet in order as well which is pretty uh, i just said i didn't want to click that i literally was thinking to myself i'm gonna save that it's so tempting to click the stupid fish oh my god it doesn't matter we'll be fine but um <laughs> it's just kind of annoying uh all right i don't know if we actually need to do this it looks like we probably yeah didn't um let's just kind of spend these it is really late i'm a hundred percent not getting back to where i was what I can guarantee, though, is to get to, um, we'll do Frostleaf. Yeah, we'll do Frostleaf. Um, I'll just have to make sure I save some, which should defaultly kind of do. So it shouldn't be a problem. Um, so just put a ton into there, and then obviously a ton in there. And you can see just by the amount admin goes up. And what I'm doing, by the way, is I'm just putting as many as I can possibly go into Solomon. Like, I can't buy a single level. Like, I'm clicking, you can probably hear the mouse click really loud there for a minute um you can't buy a level and then you kind of do it uh, people are asking like how much do you put an admin it's like i just put leftovers in admin that's all i'm adding to admin uh, and this is actually a really large gap so this is pretty nice uh we will ascend um get going we're gonna not have idle which is the crappy part um i still think we should do okay yeah, i just gotta get 75 levels of that uh and actually i think we're already good yeah cool nice we're gonna do it again boom beautiful another decent jump not as big as the last do we have any in here we don't all right so this is where i start to get a little worried about what i'm gonna do i'm gonna spend the 15 minutes in here we're gonna use the 18 percent if there's a hero soul quest there is not um all right i'm probably not gonna use the 42 or 41 percent then uh, I don't want to waste it um, in case I don't get either of those going on Hero Souls. I don't want to accidentally screw something up. So we're not going to do it again. We're just going to keep that, which is still, again, a relatively big, decent jump. I mean, it's, it's speeding up the process a bit. This uh, this run won't be a crazy run. Our next run will be a really high level, though. Um, but we'll chill around here for now. Just grab our 200 of everything for a ha -has. Because I don't feel like leveling up. Uh, sometimes I do 200 of everything everything sometimes i buy just 100 and then anyone that needs higher i'll buy their levels but 200 is what i used to do all the time and i still like have it to start doing it once i start doing it i just commit to it if i can't buy it there it's fine but let's do that make sure we have everything else and then we'll just let oh let it chill in frost leaf by all the abilities of course let frost leaf do its thing i know i'll probably be able to get someone else higher 
I'm going to leave him in Frost Leaf. I kind of am curious um, how far Frost Leaf will push at this stage. So that is the goal. Uh, anyways, let's save and import this into the calculator. Spend this stuff up. Uh, boom, boom, boom. I recently started playing Candy Box 2. It's been a really recommended game. Um, at the time of this recording, I actually played a bunch of it earlier. Um, a couple, couple of, uh, four episodes actually of it in one sitting. I'm like, I'm having a lot of fun with it. It's been interesting. I mean, it's getting boring at this point, but it's it's been really interesting. Uh, if you haven't checked it out, there's a couple episodes, uh, at least an episode, probably a couple by now. I think I uploaded it both days over the weekend, so. Um, check them out if you haven't already. It seems like an interesting game. Again, very short in comparison to what I'm going to be able to make other series, but it's fun. I've got a bunch of like little, like, just stupid games come into the channel um, that are not really stupid. They're actually a lot of fun. Um, coming over the next couple of weeks, uh, as well as possible some solid series that I'm trying to get established. Um, so remember to leave feedback on videos, guys. It really does show whether I'm going to keep a series going or not. Um, it's actually what killed a couple of our series that just kind of disappeared out of nowhere. It's like I wasn't having enough fun for the amount of like feedback I was getting. And a lot of fun for the videos is me is getting feedback. So if there's a little amount of feedback, it just it kind of just demotivates me to play certain games. Uh, I think 17 on that, right? Yeah. And then 16 on the next three. And by 16, I mean 116. But, um, you know what I mean. It's just... it's. I like being assured that it's something you guys are interested in seeing. Um, but, I mean... Candy Box 2, for example, we're probably going to just play through is... Really, that that's going to go till I get bored. Uh, there's only so much I can do in that. Uh, so, and some games are like that. Some are just gonna go till I get bored. One, two, three, four, uh, and then Atman. We are dropping only twenty in. So we already have them up there. So boom, boom. Uh, I'd like to get everything else to two hundred. Um, what if I just hop in? Let's try it. One, two, three. Yeah, we can get a two hundred. Everything. Sure. Let's do it. One thirty. Boom. I'm in. You convinced myself. Boom. I like it. It's not going to cost very much. It'll leave us with plenty left over. Uh, it's chipping away a little bit what it wants us to keep, but I like to get them up 200, and then we'll be able to get it to 300 and call it quits there. Um, there may be a few. I I get a bit higher. I get to like the 350 mark because that's kind of where we can get things to at the stage where I'm at. Actually, we might be able to get a little farther now. I'm not really sure, though. 200 will be pretty nice. It'll give me decent time on these. Like, I know, again, I could move guilds to someone else and go with that, but we're going to see what Frost Leap does. I'm going to leave that there. Um, and, yeah. All right, so let's go over the clan stuff. Let's get to it. A lot of changes because we have the two new officers, um, which we will go over here in a moment as we get to them. <laughs> so, anyways, starting off with... Uh, me, um, we've broken 26k, which you guys have known. Um, been pretty awesome. Went up a little over a thousand zones, which I'm happy with, as it's quite a bit of progress for me because I, I really just don't play a ton, but I'll take it. It's good. Um, we've got Fig making some progress, uh, breaking a 23,000, so congrats, my friend. Uh, Toasty, new officer of Lama Empire, uh, breaking 17 and 18,000. I'm getting close to 19,000, uh, which is pretty sweet. Making a lot of progress. I believe he was transcended last week almost to the point of breaking highest zone as we took the informa information and then <laughs> so he did that and they got a, I think he got two transcendences in basically pretty sure that's what happened there uh, Ethan's made pretty much the same progress um, uh, exactly actually made it actually gained a slightly bit on him I guess from week to week but basically the same progress breaking 18k so congrats dude uh, we got Rubik's um, climbing up a little bit. Rubik slowed down a little bit this week, which is cool. Um, getting about 500 zones. Not bad. Um, not quite breaking 18k. Uh, we got I Don't Know breaking 16k, man. Congrats. Anthony breaking 12 and 13. And that 13k under his belt. Cool, my dude. Uh, CJ going up about 800 zones. Getting really close to 13k, but not quite. Um, also a new uh, officer. Um, handling Lamination 3 for us. Uh, we got Robert Wolf, uh, climbing up a decent bit of zones, getting really close to that 11k mark. Uh, we've got 9 lives, breaking 10k. So at the moment, everyone in Lamination is um, 
in 10k, which we'll talk about this after we finish this whole thing up. We're going to talk a little bit about um, Lamination and what's going on with this. Um, not the three other clans, just Lamination. We'll talk about that after. But um, Impulsic breaking 9k. Congrats, dude. That's awesome. 9k. Dude, so close to 10k. You got to get it next week. You got to just push it. I know it's a decent bit of zones, so I would understand if you don't. But come on, man. Look at 10k. It's right there. You can smell it. You can lick it, dude. <laughs> We got Snowcat, uh, new member, coming in at 7290. Welcome, my friend. Enjoy yourself. I don't know if you're in the Discord, but if you're not, hop in the Discord. Let me know who you are. PM me. Let me know. Be like, yo, I'm Snowcat. And um, I will uh, add you to the ranks if I have not already done that. Um, Never Lose has not moved this week. We've got a new member, Seth Popkin. Um, we're going to just call him Seth because I normally just pick one word and call them that. So Seth, uh, coming in at 61.95. Not bad, man. Possibly breaking 7K next week. I'm not sure what Seth normally progresses, but we'll see. Uh, Maldox has not moved this week. We've got a Cyborg uh, breaking 6K. So congrats, man. That's pretty awesome. Uh, Kitten climbing up just a little bit. Not doing too much progress, but hey, a climb is a climb. Uh, we got... Oh, didn't I run into the problem pronouncing this before during the comments of the day? Uh, Kirio? Kirio, right? We're going to go with Kirio. I think that's right. I don't know. I don't I don't know how to pronounce all the, the weird names like that. So I'm, I'm bad at stuff. I'm bad at pronouncing names. I'm terrible at that. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. If you guys haven't known that by now, um, you guys clearly have not been watching me very long. Uh, but coming into the clan at 5536, welcome, my friend. Glad to have you. Uh, we got Darth uh, breaking at 5K, dude. That's awesome. 5K, halfway to 10K. You'll be there one day. Maybe. Who knows? Maybe you'll give up by then or get bored by then or, you know, Cookie Heroes 2 will come out by then and you'll, again, I'm still banking on Cookie Heroes. I talk about this all the time. Not really in the videos, I suppose, but Cookie Heroes 2, it's got to be better than Cookie Heroes. Full replacement. It's what we want. Don't want to have to play both to satisfy two different urges of the game. <laughs> but anyways, coughing has not moved this week. Hopping over to the second sheet. We got Naor. Uh, moving up a little bit. Not too much progress coming out. About 100 zones. Not too bad, though. Uh, we got Chippakilla, who has not moved this week. We got Bardo, who has broken 4K. So congrats, dude. That's awesome. We got Zorax breaking 3K. Sweet. 3K and 2K, I guess. But getting past that 3K. Mark is beautiful. I remember back when I was at 3K, thinking I'd never be anywhere much higher than that <laughs> we got noob not progressing at all come on man let's go uh void tree uh, getting close to 3k i'm getting up to 2800 getting past the halfway mark through the 2000s at least uh, monkey as a new member coming in at 2855 welcome dude uh we got a dragon army who i know is in pure competition with void tree <laughs> um coming at uh uh, not coming in at, but I'm breaking 2,700. I know that they have been in the Discord chatting back and forth and seem to become, become pretty good friends, which is awesome. I love seeing relationships form in the Discord. Um, and they, they seem to be, seem to be, you know, getting a good friendship going. And I know they, they've, you know, got a little friendly competition going, which is cool. If you got someone in the clan near your zone and, you know, you're both on Discord, it's a great spot to chat about that, even though they're in different clans. That's what the Discord's there for. Um, none of us really use the clan chat, so we try to have everyone in the Discord. Even people not in the clans, Get in the Discord. It's so fun. We click your heroes talk. We got to talk about other games. We got to talk about just life. Just it's a chill zone. Occasionally we all just hop in a voice chat and just talk it up. You know, play games. If anyone has games that people are playing, you know, it's a good time. It's a good time. Anyways, Mitch, new member, coming in at twenty five eleven. Welcome, dude. Uh, I believe that was the last. No, we got one more new member coming up in a bit here. Um, we got Flame breaking. 2,000, dude. Going up a little over 1,000 zones. That's awesome, Flame. Congrats, man. Keeping that grind up. Beastly has not moved this week. We got uh, Riverman, who has not moved much, but has made some progress, breaking 1,900. So, nice, dude. Get that 2K next week. Come on. You got this. Um, I'm going to go with K-Jet. Uh, it was really hard to tell by the picture I was sent if this is spelt correctly, so if it's not, let me know. Um, I didn't want to bother Rubix on asking him if this set was spelt but the picture was really hard to tell with all like the small like letters and stuff. Um, but we're going to go with K-Jet. I hope that's right. Anyways, coming in with 1669. So welcome, my friend. We got Atom Bomb 
moving up quite a bit. Couldn't quite break that 1,000 before we took the info in. I'm sure by the, this time of the video, um, he has. And I'll, also, a lot of the kicks are happening today. I'm going to start doing kicks on Sunday slash Monday every week. Um, Saturday to Monday, basically. Um, if I'm on Saturday and the officers are around, we may do kicks then. If not, Sundays slash Mondays. So people who are weary on, they don't move. That That's going to be the plan. So just so everyone knows. Uh, Sal has not moved. We've got, oh my God, it's Tolly. I'm just gonna go with OMG. We're gonna we're gonna call him OMG, or Tolly. I don't know if it, if if that is Tolly. I'm gonna say that's Tolly. Yeah, we're gonna go with OMG. Um, if you, if you guys have a different, if it you know, different part of your name you want to pronounce differently, let me know. Uh, but we've got uh, Tolly coming in at. Oh, I forgot these are two new members too. Wow, I was completely off on the new member thing. But coming in at uh, 18 to four. Welcome, dude getting on that grind and we've got no prob llama no prob we're gonna call him no prob because i'm llama so yeah <laughs> but no prob coming in at um 10 for 104 i guess um cool that's everyone and then you see how we got closed on the three um lamination there that is because i'm not accepting new members um i will be moving people into this clan uh, whether they are 10k plus or not uh, I may move some lower levels. I may move some higher levels. I'm going to randomly pull people that I feel like I want to pull into the clan. That's what I'm going to do. Generally, they're going to be on the higher level side for sure. But it's not going to have to be like, oh, you have to be 8K+. plus. I may pull some 5Ks. I may pull some 6Ks. I probably won't pull below 5K, to be honest. Uh, but it's going to be members that have been around for a good while. Um, that's kind of my idea. Good members that are around for a while, making good progression, um, because I don't like kicking people from Lamination. I like to let people kind of chill and leave at their own time. So if we keep it this way, I know they're good people. They're going to move up a lot. Um, I'm, it's, I'm trying to make it the clan that people can move into. They can get in the clan that I'm in. They, you know, they can come chill in that clan. Um, kind of like a reward for hanging around the community for a while, I guess you could say, to get into the Lamination. You know? So that's kind of the idea of that. I know it may not be the best idea, but that's the plan. I'm going to try it. We're going to roll with it. Um, again, I don't want to accept anyone new. Do not request in this clan. You will get declined. Um, it's just this is what I'm going to do. I mean, I, I don't care. I mean, a very rare occasion I'll accept you. So I, I would honestly join the Discord. Get involved. Talk to me there. Let me meet you. Let me talk to you. Then we may move you up. Um, we may move you, I could, you, you know, that's your best shot at getting moved straight in if you are like, you know, 8k already and the other three clans are full. It's like, get in the discord, get involved. That's what I want. Um, I'm really trying to urge everyone to just get involved with the community. Um, even if you just play and you don't want to join one of the clans or if you're too high where you're in your own solo clan, just, just hop in here and chill. It's, it's a fun time guys. Um, great spot. We just, we just hang out. I don't know. Anyways, that is going to be it for the video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. If so, please smack the like button. And as always, I will catch you in the next one. Peace.